Hello travelers, welcome to Lore Spire. Today is DLC day for Wrath of the Righteous. Yes, the Inevitable Excess DLC has been released and with it comes patch 1.2. Patch 1.2 is absolutely massive. It fixes a large number of bugs and gameplay issues and some units like the beloved Beer Elementals finally get unique models. Way overdue. Anyways, there is far too much included in the patch for me to cover here, so I'll include a link to the patch notes in the description for anyone who wants to read through them. Now for the main attraction, the Inevitable Excess DLC. I'm not actually going to play through any of it here because I don't want to spoil any of it for anybody, but we are going to go ahead and start a game real quick just to show everyone how to do so. Okay, so go to New Game, then select Inevitable Excess, choose your difficulty, and here you will have a choice to either import a character or create a new character. Okay, as far as I can tell, you can only import the characters that you've used to uh, beat the game with, okay, or that you've at least made it to the final battle with uh, a Rilu. You need to have made it at least that far. Um, and only the most recent save that you have on that save file. Uh, so only the most recent character that you beat the, the game with on that save file. Okay, so to begin with, we're going to choose create new character because I did have an issue. Uh, I don't know if you'd really call it a bug, but uh, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and explain it here. Whenever I first tried to create a new character... Once I got here to the uh, class selection page, I could not select a class and I could not move forward. I had to go back and disable my mods. And after I disabled my mods, I was able to create a character as normal. So if you're having issues creating a character, try disabling your mods and uh, that should fix it. Okay, so for now, just to exit the process we're going to go ahead and uh, load in with uh, this character we'll import it and uh, just to let you know if you did create a new character <clears throat> after you load it into the game you would be presented with the same respec level up screen that you get whenever you um, talk to Hilor and ask him to uh, allow you to retrain your characters okay so you would just use that screen at this point to go ahead and level from 1 to 20 and from mythic rank 1 through 10 and then you would begin the dlc with that character okay if you import a character then you just start off with that character as it is whenever you import it and you can begin the dlc from here okay and that's pretty much all i'm going to show you i'll let you all discover the adventure on your own it's going to be freaking awesome so get out there save the space time continuum oh and I did create a themed character for this DLC. So make sure you're subscribed and the notification bell is on so that uh, whenever that build comes out, either tomorrow or Saturday, gonna try to make it tomorrow, but either day, um, whenever it comes out, you do not miss it because it's themed for the DLC and it's extremely effective. Should be awesome to play. All right, that's about it. This has been Chris with Lorespire. Be well, my friends.